Hey guys, it's Rainy. So for these decorations or toppers, I'm gonna be doing this template of this bee. This is from the poster of the Barbie movie. I just arranged it with editing. So I'm just gonna be dragging that 12 word document. And from there, I'm just gonna be making this smaller. You can make this bigger or smaller depending on what you need. So if you need a bigger size for, let's say, cupcakes, like standard cupcakes, this is the size that I would go for. And this is what it looks like. So you can kind of get an idea of what it looks like. So if you like that size, it's gonna be on my blog. But I'm gonna be making them smaller because I don't have cupcakes. I'm gonna be using something else that I'm gonna show you in a minute. Printed and when I print it, I just print it in black and white because this is just a template anyways. I just don't need them to be pink. But if you were gonna print them and use this as like the final decor, you can make a bunch of them like this, copy paste, and then just print them pink. And to make them, I'm gonna be using some gum paste. I do have the review coming soon, by the way. I used to use fondant for this kind of decorations, but I switched. But I'm gonna be coloring this in this pink beautiful coloring and i do have the review for this one it's by wilton but i'm gonna be rolling my gum paste first with the roller that i think this one is by wilton with those rings that it has but it ended up being too thick for what i wanted to go for so i just ended up using this other roller that has those two rings i do have the diy for those in case you want something with some thickness but it's not like super thick placing my bees on top in there letting my gum paste dry a little bit so i can cut them and once that's done i'm gonna be using my exacto knife and then just cut them it's really easy then for the white part i'm going to be using those same beads that i used before but i'm going to be cutting the black or the gray axis around it because i just need the b part like the white part for this i would highly suggest you to work with like finer scissors something that is meant to trim eyebrows or just eyelashes and stuff like that because they tend to be pointier and just finer and they're going to be much easier for this kind of more detailed work rolling more gum paste in this case i'm not going to be coloring this and then just placing those bees pretty much doing the same thing that i did before but this time is gonna be a bit more tricky because everything is more delicate and daintier yeah i just took my time and just working parts and took breaks as i was cutting them but yeah this is the part that took me the longest but i think this is gonna be like the deal breaker as in this is like the whole point of this thing so if it looks good it's gonna look amazing and if it doesn't it's gonna look you're gonna have to do another one working with one at a time just because they are like the main focus pink background if you just cut the wrong part or whatever it's gonna be like super noticeable so i try to do my best hopefully it turn out that way but now we're gonna be gluing these two pieces together i'm using some water and this wilton brush some people use other thing that i don't remember what the name is but the water works just as fine that is pretty much up to you and yeah just be careful because this oopsies can happen but it's oh okay God. because if you act fast nothing happens you just arrange it fast and this is pretty much what they look like by themselves i think they look super cute and they are time consuming it's like a lot of details but i think the end result looks really cute and it's worth it obviously you can use this to decorate cakes cupcakes cookies whatever but i just have and welcome to my mess a pie a lemon pie to be exact so i just figured instead of like making new cupcakes i would use this instead because we already have this one i'm just gonna be making not even bite size but make them smaller just so that i can display my decorations on top using a cookie cutter actually to cut this mini round pies and i actually like the idea so i just wanted to go for this and to get them i'm guiding myself from like the size of cupcakes with my cookie cutter that is from the set and then just using that part that has like the detail not that it's like super visible the detail at the end but this is how i cut it them it's actually really easy if you have a pie that you want to cut into like smaller bites but it's going to be messy so i'm just going to be cutting them and then just placing the leftovers on this tupperware so nothing goes to waste but i just wanted to make the pie thing this just to show you what they would look like displayed but this is what they would sort of look like in cupcakes you can display them like standing up or just leaning against it or in a slice of cake it's pretty much up to you i just want to share with you how to make them this is inspired by barbie movie and i also made that barbie decor if you want to check it out i'm really excited about the movie and hopefully you liked it as much as i did if you did don't forget to give this a thumbs up check out the other cupcake decorations and share this thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye